Today I want to share with you a couple of sling bag options from the company Altered State. I grabbed these recently from a company called Altered State. Um, I saw them on Instagram and I really loved, first of all, I saw this one and I thought it was so cute. Um, it has a really cute checkered pattern and then just the hardware and the detail with the stripes on the strap. Um, I thought it was so cute. So I went to their website and then I also found these sling bags here that have um, a really nice feeling vegan leather material and a really fun colorful strap to it as well. So since they were around $50 each, I wanted to grab them to see how the quality felt, the zippers felt nice, and I am very pleased to say that I do like the quality of these bags. Um, I feel like the hardware is nice and sturdy, the zippers are super nice and smooth, and the feel of both of the straps feels nice and thick and soft and durable. So I think these are a really great buy. I'm going to for sure link them down below so you can go check them out. I just love the design of these slings. It has this awesome um, O-ring right here that you can attach um, this clip to. So that is keeping this front section secure because this is just a really fun little open pocket here. And then if you unclip that, you can easily get into your main compartment here. Um, on the inside of the checkered one it is a black interior, but since it is a smaller bag, um, that's okay. Usually I like it to have a light interior, but if it's small enough, I think it's all right. There is a slip pocket in the back there. And then on the back side of the bag, there is another little zippered pocket that goes across. And you have two D-rings down at the bottom so that you can adjust this to whichever side you want and wear it on whichever shoulder. Um, I love how versatile. You can wear it in the front, you can wear it on your back, you can kind of wear it down to the side. Um, I'll show you at the end of the video all the different ways that I like wearing these bags. I think they're so fun and cute. They have a lot of different um, color options on the website as well. So I ordered this um, gray vegan leather, but they also have a brown and also a black, and they all have a really fun, colorful strap to them. And as I was looking at both of these, even though they're two separate kind of things, they're not named the same bag, they're set up exactly the same way. So you have an O-ring here on the front, this pocket right here is where I have slipped in my cell phone. I think it's the perfect place um, to easily access it, but I'm not worried about it falling out anywhere or anything. So my phone goes in that pocket. And then I also have in there a couple of um, lip products. And then for easy access on the back, I have kept my wallet. So this is the Ondar Denner wallet and that fits in there with no problem. Like I said, the zippers are really nice and smooth, but I like having my wallet on that side because that's the side that's gonna be against your body. And it's a zipper closure, so it's not something that's gonna easily get misplaced or stolen or lost. And then on the inside, I was very excited to find that I can actually fit way more than I thought. So let me just open this up here. Right on top, I have my earbuds. And I also like how far down the zipper goes, so this folds down pretty far. And I have thrown in a snack. Um, I've put in my portable phone charger because I could see this being a really great theme park bag if you just want something little on your body um, and you need to have a charger so that you have more <laughs> life of your phone. When you're at a theme park, um, that fits in there perfectly. I've thrown in a little, um, this is the Lemon Perfect Hydrating Lemon Water, but I got this at Costco if you're interested. They're really yummy. Um, but if you're needing just like a little beverage or a water right there, that actually does fit in there with no problem, which I was excited about because if you're going to like a park or something on a walk with the kids, it's nice to have some water with you, maybe a snack. And then I did try and throw in um, my diaper, an extra diaper and wipes just in case to see if they would fit and they fit in perfectly. And then same thing in this design, you have a slip back pocket inside of here, and the inside of this one is a little bit lighter with a fun design. And in this back pocket, I'm keeping my keys attached to the tether that comes with that Denner wallet. And then I have my hand sanitizer back there as well. So great little everyday quick trip kind of bag. Let me show you quickly all those same items packed into this one and then I'll show you what they look like on the body.
Okay, interesting. As I was packing this up, I felt like the vegan leather version had a little more give and a little more room. Um, this one also is a fabric kind of material, so it's all more of like a woven fabric. Um, so I think if you're looking for something that's going to last the longest and give you maybe a little more wiggle room, I would say probably go with the vegan leather option. Again, they do have a really pretty black and brown option as well. If you have questions about these bags, please let me know down in the comments below. I'll be sure to link them so you can easily find where they are at. Also, I would love to know if there's any other like budget friendly bags that you guys have found that the quality is really good and you have loved using them. Um, please let me know because I would love to share more budget-friendly items and bags on my channel. I hope you guys are enjoying these small minimal bags this week and I will see you soon for my next one.